South Asia dominates the global ship recycling industry accounting for a staggering 80% of the sector with India's Alang Ship Breaking Yard at the forefront. However, the last two years have presented significant hurdles for the once thriving hub. Recent statistics reveal a concerning trend. September 2024 saw Alang Ship beaching only six ships, a steep contrast to the 12 vessels that arrived during the same month in 2023, along ship recycling industry facing significant problems for the last two years and there is no sign of recovery shortly as well. Under the normal circumstances, Alang, known for its vast coastline and established infrastructure, typically dismantles an average of 25 ships per month. Yet a combination of geopolitical tension and rising shipping cost has resulted in sharp decline in the number of vessels reaching its shore. The ongoing conflicts in the Middle East, particularly Israel, Hamas, Hezbollah situation, have heightened uncertainties and global shipping routes contributing to this slowdown situation. The Baltic dry index, a key indicator of shipping rates, continues to soar, driving up operational costs for ship owners. Many are opting to repair and refurbish the old vessels rather than send them for breaking yards, leading to a direct decrease in the volume of ships designated for dismantling. In the first nine months of 2024, Alang managed to receive only 73 ships, weighing total of 537,759 metric ton. This figure is significantly lower compared to 92 ships that arrived in the same time frame in year 2023, weighing a cumulative 680,646 metric ton. September 2024 alone witnessed the beaching of just six ships, totaling 38,388 metric ton, down from 12 ships and 65,489 metric ton in September 2023. Breaking down the numbers for the current year, along so a uh, peak in the ship arrival in January 2024 with 15 vessels while subsequent months showed a troubling decline. January 15 ship, February 8 ship, March 5 ships, April 3 ships, May 12 ships, June 10, July 4 ships, August 10 ships, September 6 ships. Only four months so far in year 2024 have seen double-digit ship arrival, a stark indicator of, of the ongoing difficulties facing at the Alang Ship Recycling Yard. The decline in ship breaking activities has far-reaching economic implication for the region. Alang is not just ship breaking yard. It supports thousands of jobs from laborers on going ground to those involving logistic and ancillary services. With fewer ships arriving, many workers face uncertain future and local economics that rely on ship breaking are feeling the strain. The ship breaking industry in India is critical not only for recycling materials but also for the livelihood of countless families. The decline raises questions about the sustainabilities of the sector amidst global economic pressure and rising operational cost. Industry experts suggest that unless the geopolitical situation stabilizes and shipping rates decrease, Alang may continue to struggle with low ship arrival. The trend of ship owner choosing to repair old vessel for continuous service rather than sending them for dismantling is likely to persist. The resilience of the ship breaking industry in India will depend on its availability to adapt to these challenges.
potential situation and solution may include investing in advanced technologies for ship recycling to improve efficiency and reduce cost as well as exploring new market for ship breaking services as september 2024 draws to a close the ship breaking yard at Erlang finds itself a critical juncture with the combination of geopolitical turmoil and economic pressure impacting the global shipping industry. The path forwarding remains uncertain. Stakeholders in Erlang must navigate these challenges carefully to secure the future of one of the South Asia's most vital industry. While Alang has long been beacon in the shipbreaking sector, its ability to thrive in the face of the adversity will determine not only its fate but also that of the thousands who depend on it for their livelihoods. Thank you very much for watching this video till then. We'll meet you with some other stories on shipping and maritime sector. Till then, stay safe. Bye-bye. And please visit our web portal also for regular updates www.shippinginbox.com. Thank you.